Welcome back YouTube, we have Ahmed again from In-Depth Tech Reviews and in today's video I'm going to show you a helpful tool called System Repair. The System Repair tool can help you solve most of your iOS device issues like the iPhone boot loop, frozen screen, unexpected restart and more. But the best part it can do all of that without losing your data. So let's take a deep dive in the System Repair tool to know more. But before getting started, let's make sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon to get notified every time I post a new video. So let's jump in. Now let's start with the features. The system repair tool is designed to solve your iOS device issues with your data in mind. Usually when you encounter an issue that doesn't allow you to use your iPhone, the only option that comes to your mind is a software restore using iTunes, which is correct, but what if you don't have a backup for your data? And if that's the case, restoring your iPhone will be a so painful step to take. With this tool, Wondershare claims that they can fix most of the critical issues you may encounter with your iOS device, like iPhone is stuck in recovery mode, stuck in DFU mode, white screen of death, iPhone black screen, boot loop, unexpected restart, and more without losing your data. But before showing you how to use it, let me quickly show you the installation process. Just click the link in the description below and click on download now, and it will download the installation file compatible with your computer, either Windows or Mac, and in my case it will be Windows. Run the file, wait for a few minutes for the installation to complete, click on start now and you are good to go. And here is the doctor phone toolkit interface showing on the screen and you can click on the system repair tile to get it up and running. Now the tool is giving you two options, either standard or advanced. The standard option is the one needed if you want to try solve your iOS device issue without losing your data, but if that didn't work for any reason your second option will be the advanced mode which will unfortunately erase your device, but you can keep this option as your last resort. Once you click on the standard mode, the system repair tool will ask you to connect your iOS device to the computer. And once you do that, you will be presented with this screen. It will show you your iPhone model, the software version it's on, and the three other buttons. The download button will allow you to download the software using your browser, which is convenient because you will be able to keep the software image at any place you want on your computer, and the select button will allow you to browse your files to locate the software image if you already have it downloaded or you can simply hit the start button and the tool will download and install the software on your device. So now let's hit the start button and once you do that the automatic download process will start and as you see it's downloading a 3.98 gigabytes file which is the iOS 13.5.1 image. After the download finishes, you will get another screen with the button called Fix Now, and once you click on it, the tool will install the software on your iPhone. And here we go. I installed the software on my iPhone 7 Plus, and it works as expected with all the data on the device. And when it comes to the advanced mode, it works exactly the same as the standard, but it will erase your data. To be honest, I wasn't able to test the tool with a broken iPhone because I don't have one. But if you have any doubts about the system repair tool, you still can get your free trial to test it without paying for a license. And even if you pay it already, you still have a seven days money back guarantee policy in place. And when it comes to the pricing, now you can see all the pricing options on the screen and you can pick the one that suits your budget. So that's pretty much it. That was my quick review for the system repair tool for iOS from Wondershare. Please let me know in the comments what do you think. And if you like my video, please hit the thumbs up and subscribe for more videos. Thank you for watching.